Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. It is our understanding that they've gone with a 4-5-1. Well, the lone striker has to be prepared to do some of the work himself, but essentially he needs two of the three central midfielders to make runs beyond him and trust that the wide men can, can service the penalty box and make those link-up runs from out to in. He should get plenty of support with this setup. We have already started here. Close up. be a throw in Christensen knocks it away in with a header and it's hoisted clear oh it's die hard defense and the willingness to put his body on the line very impressive seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Pulisic. Pulisic. Has it out wide now. Beats it first time! And in again. We can get that clear. Raspilicueta. Neither side yet able to find the net. Gets it upfield. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Raspilicueta plays it forward. Close up. Forward it goes. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Close up. Tries to get it forward quickly. Giroud plays it out to the flank, going through, and now the finish, and the finish! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling, his reflexes were ultra-sharp. Marcos Alonso goes short. Pulisic, and he just whacks it away, now it's Giroud, it's Giroud, it's there, first blood drawn. The keeper deserves some sympathy there, he may not have seen that until too late.
A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Aimed low and direct. He's got through. Now it's Shiru. He's left his... It's an in! Really well taken goal. And already they're looking to run away with it. Well, I think there's a few trying to claim offside, but he looks to have been on. Yeah, he was on. So that's two now without reply. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Pulisic. Giroud. He's got Giroud! And it's there! Hot knife through butter! They have done it again! The understanding between those two plays a big part in that and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. He's made it three, quite a day at the office for him. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single-handedly. They don't know how to stop him. Three. There's the whistle for half time. Well, there's plenty that can be said about the last 45 minutes, but one thing that cannot be said is that it's dull. One sided, yes, but packed with excitement. Peter, do I really need to say anything, or can I simply refer you to the scoreline? Really has been an astonishing game, peppered with goals. You cannot help feeling that the second half will supply more. So we're already into the second period. Pulisic. Closer, gets it back. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Christensen battles to win it back. And it's Giroud. Looking to break out here. Now oh, it's Kante. Giroud with a shot! And he should have made it four. Chelsea know they can rely on the counter, and they've just expressed a warning. Towering header! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Giroud plays it out to the wing. Keeps everyone guessing. Just deflected over the goal line for a corner. Up to meet it. Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. Pulisic did so well to make use of the little space that was afforded to him. It wasn't easy, that. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. He's got options out wide. Byram. Well, it's normally around now that the managers think about making changes. Byram. Whistle's gone, that's a foul.
Played out to the right. Byram. And helps available out wide. Just brushed off the ball. He's had a go! It goes to show he is human after all. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. Cuts it out. Now it's Rhodes. Out wide to the right. Now it's Giroud. Dashing forward at pace. And it's William. Ball through needs to be good here. Giroud with a shot! What about it? Surely now they are well and truly out of sight. Oh, that always looked the likely outcome. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Four in the game, he is the man. So, the manager making the last of his changes. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Well, no question now as to who is in control. Going through. A chance to play it in. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. finish Marcos Alonso plays it forward out to the left it goes played into space out wide oh, nice touch played into the middle they didn't manage to get nearly enough into the box and that speaks of little ambition over to the left Added on will be two minutes. Dermic with a delicate piece. Had a shot! The whistle has gone and it is all over. Well, a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. How would you summarize what we've seen?